actually, a, or phytic acid, I should say, is actually a storage form of phosphorus, the light bearer. Phosphorus is found in consumer products that emit light watches. And remember those old time watches they used to have that had the little, uh, the, the, uh, the glow in the dark phenomena. It's all based on phosphorus. Specialty electronic inks have phosphorus in them. Smoke bombs, explosives. Phosphorus was used in World War I as part of chemical warfare. Phosphorus is part of, uh, part of pesticides because of its ability to con interfere with electrical energy in insects and pests. And along with potassium and nitrogen, phosphorus is a critical element for the growth of plants. Phytates, phytic acid, can be thought of as a trapped form of phosphorus. Seeds will trap phosphorus to maintain their dormancy, to keep them asleep. Seeds are supposed to be asleep, and one of the ways they maintain their sleepiness, if you will, is by trapping phosphorus. The technical name for, for phytic acid is inositol hexaphosphate, as in hexa, meaning six, and phosphate, meaning phosphorus. There's six elements of phosphorus attached to an element called inositol, which is a type of vitamin. So IP6 or phytic acid, if you will, whatever you want to call it, IP6, inositol, hexaphosphate, phytic acid, or phytates are basically locked up forms of phosphorus. They're an element of inositol with six elements of phosphorus tied together. And this keeps the plant's energy in a potential state, in a possibility state, rather than in an actual state. There's two kinds of energy. You've got potential energy or stored energy, and then you have active energy or dynamic energy. Those are the two main types of energy. When a plant is growing or when anything's growing or when anything's moving, its energy is in a movement state, a dynamic state. I guess they call kinetic energy, as opposed to when it's locked up, tied up, that's called potential energy. So you got potential energy and you got kinetic energy. A seed is in a seed's energy is in the potential state, and phytic acid is one of the ways that a seed maintains its energy in this sleepy potential state. This anti-growth property, this anti-movement property, anti-dynamic property of seeds is what keeps them asleep. It keeps them dormant until water comes into the picture. And this is one reason why sprouting seeds and sprouting grains and sprouting beans can have such important nutritional benefits. You're actually freeing up the energy. You're turning that energy, which is in a stored potential state, into a, an explosive kinetic state, into a dynamic state. And you can also mitigate some of the, some of the uh, mineral binding effects of these phytic acid, of these phytates and phytic acid by using water. So sprouting seeds and sprouting grains not only releases the energy, but it also uh, uh, diminishes the phytic acid and phyt phytates ability to lock up zinc and lock up calcium and lock up magnesium and iron and other growth minerals. This is just another reason why sprouting can be so good for you. Other vegetables like garlic and onions particularly can help reduce phytic acid's ability to bind minerals. If you like the flavor of onions and garlic, most people like onions at least, it's probably a good idea to use a little bit of onion, onion juice, or grind up some onions, or chop up some onions or garlic when you're cooking grains, or cooking beans, or cooking any veggies for that matter, which can have phytic acid in them, or phytates. This is especially important if you're a vegetarian or a vegan, and you're eating lots of grains, or you're eating lots of beans. Another important strategy, for freeing up phytic acid or, or making phytic acid less tenacious when it comes to binding minerals is fermentation. Bacteria have an ability to process phytic acid and process phytates and then release the minerals, release the phosphorus, and also release or, or uh, reduce the phytic acid's ability to tie up minerals. And this is a reason why fermenting grains, another reason why fermentation is so helpful, fermenting grains and seeds with good bacteria. And it's also a reason why using probiotic supplements, using the Biolumin Nightly Essence from Longevity, using the Jordan Rubin Probiotic Enriched Cheese, using the Swear of V, and using the Amasai, and eating fermented foods in general can be an important part of nutritional health. This is just another reason why you want to interact with fermented foods. You'll help break up the phytic acid or reduce the phytic acid's ability to lock up minerals. And by the way, this is one of the reasons why dis biosis or messed up gut bacteria can be so problematic. If you don't have enough gut, gut bacteria, the wrong kinds of gut bacteria, you may not be able to free up the minerals from the phytic acid if you're eating lots of grains or eating lots of veggies or eating lots of beans or seeds. And by the way, this anti-growth property that phytic acid has is not necessarily a bad thing. 
This ability that phytic acid has to tie up growth minerals like zinc and iron and calcium may have actually some anti-cancer benefits. In fact, there are folks who believe that phytic acid, or IP6 as it's called, inositol, inositol hexaphosphate, may have chemotherapy benefits, chemotherapy-like benefits, medicinal properties that in the same way that they can keep normal cells from growing and dividing, they may be able to keep cancer cells from growing and dividing. And as far as zinc goes, which is what we're talking about here, and we'll probably be talking about for the next day or two. By the way, tomorrow we're going to have a really interesting guest on, Dr. Uh, Andrew, uh, Dan, Dr. Andrew Harley is going to be talking about zinc depletion and mineral depletion out of the soils. He's a Ph.D. geologist, and he's got an expertise in soil depletion. Uh, he's part of Longevity, and he's a good friend. I've been, having, been trying to get him on the air now for a while. He's going to be on tomorrow. We'll be talking about zinc depletion from the soils. Phytic acid also has a role to play when it comes to zinc deficiencies. In addition to zinc depletion from the soils, eating lots of grains and beans and seeds can be a reason why many of us are zinc deficient. Phytic acid plays a, plays a significant role in tying up zinc like it ties up other minerals. And this is especially important, as I said, for vegans and vegetarians. Zinc is a growth element. It's a building element. It's a skin element. It's a genetic element. And this is why seeds are great zinc sources, by the way, but it's also why seeds may keep you from making that zinc that's in the seeds available. Eggs and dairy are also good sources of zinc. Again, eggs and dairies are growth foods. All your growth elements, growth foods, are going to be sources of zinc. Eggs and dairy, you don't have, if you're getting your zinc from eggs and dairy, you don't have to worry about phytates and phytic acid. Same with meats. Organ meats in particular are good sources of zinc, and you're not going to have to worry about phytic acid. Phytic acid is found in seeds because seeds are growth elements, but you can get your zinc from eggs and dairy and organ meats and not have to worry about the phytates. Zinc is a major player in genetics. In fact, zinc is somewhat quintessential when it comes to uh, the story of epigenetics. Epigenetics is the, the science of how nutritional elements affect our genes, and zinc is like a poster child for epigenetics. A little chunk of zinc actually hangs on to the gene. It's called a zinc finger. And genes have an extension of amino acids, and at the top of that extension you have a little piece of zinc. That's called a zinc finger, and it's responsible for keeping the genome, the genetics, healthy and strong. Zinc fingers, this long string of, of amino acids with a zinc cap, if you will, on the gene, keeps the DNA folded in just the right shape. Zinc is a major player in the development of the embryo and the fetus. It's involved in protein metabolism and the integrity of fetal DNA. In this way, zinc is a, a major player in the health of cells and cell division and growth, cell growth in the uh, developing fetus or the developing uh, embryo. This is an example of something Doc Wallach has been talking about for decades, the idea that there's no genetic diseases, but rather nutritional deficiency diseases that affect the health and integrity of the genetics. If mom is deficient in zinc, the chances are really good that the infant or the fetal, the fetal genome is going to be, uh, is going to, uh, there's going to be problems in the fetal genome as well, which can show up as so-called genetic defects. Virtually anyone can hack your cell phone and track your calls, your texts, your emails, your every movement, but only if they can detect a signal. Stay one step ahead of hackers and Big Brother with a Block It Pocket, a custom-made pocket infused with pure silver that creates a complete Faraday enclosure for your cell phone. For free shipping to the lower 48, visit BlockItPocket.com or call 888-315-9618, BlockItPocket.com, enhancing health and privacy. My Magic Mud is a tooth whitening powder that removes plaque and detoxifies your mouth. It's safe for your enamel, giving you a beautiful polish and a dentist light clean after every use. My Magic Mud is also the perfect remedy for pain caused by sensitivity. It strengthens your teeth and gums for a strong, healthy smile. The ingredients are 100% natural and it's safe for children. Simply brush with My Magic Mud right before bedtime for a cleaning you can count on. Visit MyMagicMud.com. For over five years, you've been hearing about the Berkey guy, so you may know a few things about him. For example, you are well aware of the superior quality and effectiveness of Berkey water filters and accessories. 
But did you know the Berkeys have had independent lab tests done to prove just how effective they are? It's true, and he can email you the test results. Just visit GoBerkey.com. You may also know that the Berkey guy has helped tens of thousands of people get better prepared. Now here's something you may not know. GoBerkey.com has amazing specials and deals all the time on a wide variety of survival and preparedness products, most ready to ship same day. Visit the Berkey guy at GoBerkey.com and be sure to click the red Products on Sale Now button. You can always call toll-free 877-886-3653. Again, that's 877-886-3653. GoBerkey.com, home of the Berkey guy. Don't complain about your cable bill going up and up and up. Do something about it. Grab a pencil and jot down this special number. 1-855-905-MY-TV. The more cable TV rates go up, the better digital satellite TV looks. Say goodbye to the cable guy and get more of your favorite channels in 100% digital quality for less money. Call 1-855-905-MY-TV. Sign up for packages starting as low as $19.99 and there's no equipment to buy. You get free HD TV upgrade, a free DVR upgrade, and free professional and installation. You control what you watch when you watch it. Record your favorite shows, pause and rewind live TV, even skip the commercials. Watch local channels too. At just $19.99, what are you waiting for? Pull out your major credit or debit card. Call 1-855-905-MY-TV. 1-855-905-MY-TV. Say goodbye to the cable guy. Cut costs and get more. 1-855-905-MY-TV. 1-855-905-MY-TV. We live in a complicated society. Stressful issues are always popping up. Have you ever been treated unfairly by someone? Have you ever been overcharged for a repair? Have you ever signed a contract or a document? Worried about identity theft? How many times have you been in those unique situations where you just wanted to call an attorney to find out if you're right or wrong or what your legal rights are? But every time you think about calling an attorney, what do you think about first? That's right. Who do you call and how much will it cost? Our friends at Legal Shield have found a solution. With a nationwide network of 6,900 attorneys who average over 19 years of experience, Legal Shield's law firms take over 40,000 calls per week helping their members. For less than $20 per month, you can have access to Legal Shield on everything from the trivial to the traumatic. Let Legal Shield stand up for your rights at lsprotection.com. That's lsprotection.com. Or call 855-340-SAVE. 855-340-7283. Results will vary from case to case. If you need to say happy birthday, happy anniversary, thank you, or simply I'm thinking of you, ProFlowers.com is the key. ProFlowers has stunning bouquets, like the best-selling 100 blooms for $19.99. Plus, ProFlowers will include a glass vase for free. Sending someone a wonderful surprise of beautiful flowers sent fresh from the field is easy. Choose the bouquet you like, pick the delivery date, and each order is 100% guaranteed. Plus, all bouquets from Pro Flowers are guaranteed to last at least seven full days. Beautiful, fragrant flowers, picked fresh and sent to your loved one for lasting enjoyment. To get this incredible savings and send someone 100 gorgeous blooms with a free vase for $19.99, go to ProFlowers.com, click the blue microphone in the top right corner, and enter code PLOW. That's ProFlowers.com. Click the mic and enter code PLOW. Great minds think alike. The network for the independent-minded. The Genesis Communications Network. GCN. All right, we're back on the bright side. I am Pharmacist Ben. Thank you for being here. Tomorrow we'll continue talking zinc, and we'll talk about how zinc is related to those all-important signaling molecules, because that's what we're really talking about here is signaling molecules. That is chemicals that help cells do what they're supposed to do. Of course, nutrition and nutritional supplements are key players in how these signaling molecule, molecules work. And zinc is a classic example of a nutritional element that plays a role in the, uh, the efficacy, the efficiency of uh, the effectiveness of signaling molecules, specifically prostaglandins. And we'll talk about that tomorrow. There's also another very important nutrient that um, I don't know if we'll get to tomorrow. 
uh, but we'll certainly be covering the next few days a very, very important element when it comes to prostaglandin health. Uh, I should say very important vitamin when it comes to prostaglandin health, and we'll talk about that in the coming days. As we continue talking, signaling molecules and arginine and amino acids on the bright side. Okay, our number today is 855-660-4261. If you've got a health challenge that you need help with, let us help you out. It's so important to understand that there's a difference between health challenges and, and uh, health issues and the cause of health challenges and health issues. We are, we're led to believe that our, 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 the symptoms of our problems, the signs of our problems are the same thing as our problems and this lack of understanding of the distinction between real problems, or I should say causes of problems, and the appearance of problems. The appearance of problems is not the cause of problems.